Thank you, Miss Sandy. Can you bring him out to our room? Oh, sure. Yeah, I haven't made you co host yet. Sorry about that. What, what's his name, please? It's Dwayne Williams. All right. We do have your appearances, though. Because I think Mr. Williams is no longer on Zoom. I don't see him in the waiting room. Um, what now? He was in a breakout room. He was in a breakout room. Oh, that's what I meant. I don't see him in the breakout room. Mm -hmm. You got to make sure you turn off the uh, YouTube on your end, too, uh, the actual I see Angela Williams and Williams, but no Dwayne Williams. I'm no, not seeing him either. Yeah. Mine was on though. He signed in, right, Miss Belcher? Yeah. Yes. I just talked a while ago. He definitely Yeah, I even talked to him for a while and I had to explain to him why I needed him to say that he's Dwayne Williams to make sure that, you know, the person is who they say they are. So he left. I can give him a call, Judge, and see. I have his number, but I don't want him to come. He has another court day before our court date on the fifteenth, and I want him to know everything's on the same day. I can explain that to him. I'm in constant contact with him, or I can sign out, call him, and get him back on Zoom for you. Okay. Um. <clears throat> all right. I'm gonna call it. Good morning. The 36th District Court in the state of Michigan is now in session. The Honorable Judge Marlena Taylor is now presiding. At this time, there will be no talking, no smoking, no chewing gum, no eating or drinking, no sleeping or laying down, no driving or riding in a motor vehicle. Please keep your device on mute until addressed by staff. Also, keep your device on a leveled surface so that your face may be seen. Good morning, Your Honor. Good morning. Thank you. Now calling the matter of the people versus Dwayne Cleveland Williams. This is case number SP1323092, count one, drove while license suspended, count two, no insurance misdemeanor, count three, drove on registered or untitled vehicle. Appearances for the record, starting with counsel, please. Good morning, Your Honor. May it please the court. Leanna Belcher, P80177, on behalf of Dwayne Williams. All right. And uh, where is your client this morning, Ms. Belcher? Your, Your Honor, my client was logged into Zoom. I'm not sure if something happened with his phone that caused him to get disconnected, but he was here this morning and did check in. I have remained in constant contact with him. If Your Honor would allow me to waive his appearance, I can call him after the proceedings and explain his next court date. All right, just for this proceeding and hearing, I'm going to allow you to waive his presence. Um, he was checked in today um, by court staff, so I know he was present. Um, just make sure you give him the information. Um, how does your client, how are you sending your client at this point in time for these particular tickets? <clears throat> I'm sorry, Judge, it, your audio cut out. I'm sorry, I said, how do you stand your client at this point in time? Your Honor, we stand mute. All right, at this time, the court is going to enter a plea of not guilty on your client's behalf. Um, it's been brought to my attention that he has several tickets and several court days with me. Um, so I'm going to consolidate and bring him back on February 21st at 10 a.m. Um, he can remain via Zoom. I know that you'll be in the building. Um, if you uh, if you want to do it completely in person, we can. But I will allow him to remain on Zoom um, pending what you want to do. You can appear in person, Ms. Belcher. Um, we'll pull all of his tickets that he has yeah. open. And put it on the date. Oh, smart with him. Uh -oh. And we'll put it all on the date of February 21st at 10 a.m. 
February 21st at 10 a.m. I'll set his bond at zero dollars personal on his ticket. Thank you, attorney. If there's nothing else, that concludes this hearing. Judge, have a great day. You too. Thank you so much. Hey, Attorney Baltimore. Good morning. Happy Monday. Happy Monday. You ready? A, Judge and um, Mr. Baltimore, there was a gentleman who was on Zoom. He's Galaxy A11 because he left and his name changed. Sir, what is your name again? I wonder if you talked to him already. You're on Zoom. Okay. So, okay, Mr. I'm sorry. What did you say? Angelo Young. Okay. Mr. Young, is there a reason you left the waiting room? Um, I think Mr. Attorney Boffman told me to. Yeah. Well, and he did, he did. And you came back to the courtroom. Then I put you in a waiting room and you left. I was trying to, I, oh, uh, my, I'm sorry, something had happened. I was like trying to figure out where I was supposed to be. I saw a young lady. I think I was supposed to be there. So I got out of there, then signed back in. I'm, you're, <laughs> you're, I'm gonna put you back in the waiting room. So just don't, okay. Okay. don't touch on your phone. Okay, thank you. I'll figure it out. Okay. Anthony, you said? Angelo. Angelo, yeah. Okay. What's your name again, sir? Angelo Young. Right, Angelo Young? Yes. We got a lot of Angelos today, so I was trying to figure right. out which one to say. Okay. <laughs> yeah, Deanne, Angelo, Angelo, Angelo. Wait, wait, let me check in. Officers, I'll call the case. I'll give them uh, 10 more minutes. <clears throat> And then I call them. All right, you, you ready on these three peaks? Well, we are we ready on Angela Williams and Angelo Young and Ashley Young? Okay, give me one second.
Good morning, Madam Court Reporter. Oh, hi, Crystal. How are you? I'm doing good, Sandy. Good. I, I was wondering whether you could give me co-host capabilities so I can speak with the officers. Sure will. Thank you. Thanks. Great. Thanks. Crystal, would you mind using uh, breakout room number one? I had to tell you both, sorry about that. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, cool. I'm calling Angelo Williams first. Angelo Williams? Yes. Now calling the matters of the people versus Angelo to Carlos Williams. This is ticket number P1142762. One count drove while license suspended. Ticket P1160790, count one, failed to display a valid operator's license on a person. Count two, no insurance misdemeanor. Ticket number 376583, count one, driver's license not valid or improper. Count two, uninsured motor vehicle. Count three, unregistered motor vehicle. Ticket number 376584, one count, transport open insights in a motor vehicle. Also calling, not on the docket for today, but on show cause date of 2223, ticket number P133413, count 
Count one, drove while license suspended. Count two, no insurance misdemeanor. Appearances for the record, starting with counsel, please. Good morning, Your Honor. Harry Bachman, P55052, on behalf of the defendant. Would you state your full name for the record, sir? Angelo De Carlos Williams. Thank you, and good morning, Your Honor. As to those matters for which the defendant appears for arraignment or show cause, we're asking that the court enter a not guilty plea. We're asking that the next action date be set for a waiver trial by way of Zoom. And would indicate um, that identity is an issue here. All right. Um, that's the case. I'm also going to call ticket number P1334496. This is one count disregard signal red or amber. This ticket is in default, but it's a part of another set of tickets. Um, and I'll add that that's a civil infraction. Um, sir, do you, can you raise your right hand for me? Do you swear or affirm to tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? Yes. All right, you can put your hand down. Did you have a chance to talk with Attorney Boffman about your case and about your rights? Yes. And it's my understanding that you are requesting a bench trial. That's a trial before myself as a try and finder of facts. Is that correct, sir? Yes. All right, so I'm going to set that for a bench trial on the date of April 18th. April 18th, 2022 at 8, 9 a.m. It's going to be via Zoom. So the same way you Zoomed in today, Zoom in on that day. Okay, Mr. Williams? Yes, Your Honor. All right. Also, just so you know, you have some tickets that are in default from 2017. Okay. From 2017, we took off some late fees for those, but you need to take care of those tickets, please. Uh, okay. Uh, 2017, Your Honor, uh, with that, yes. when I, in 2017, I was still in the youth boys' home. Um, I had, you know, it's it's a long story, but people was using my infant, my identity. Okay. So did you, you didn't plead to something back in 20, look, it looks like, let me see the date. It looked like 2017. So you got quite a few things out here that somebody must have used stuff. They ended up each also pleading for these. So yeah, because I, I never I never pled guilty to any traffic violation. Okay. All right. Well, those are already in there. So do what attorney Boffman told you to do, and I'll see you back for the bench trial on April 18th. Okay. Okay. All right, then you're all set. All right. Young. Ashley Young. I'm sorry. It's okay. I have a seat in place real quick just for a moment. All right. Now calling the matter of the people versus Ashley Young. This is ticket P1202570. This is count one drive unregistered untitled vehicle. Count two, no insurance misdemeanor. Count three, drove while license suspended. Appearances for the record, starting with counsel, please. For the record, Harry Boffman, on behalf of the defendant, ma'am, state your name, please. Ashley, you call me. Your Honor, um, thank you. Say it one more time, Ms. Young. Hold on a minute, Attorney Boffman. Say it one more time, Ms. Young. Say your name. Ashley Nicole Young. Thank you so much. You can go ahead and counsel. Uh, interestingly enough, Your Honor, I just received an, a discussion, I'm in the middle of a discussion by way of text with Corporation Counsel. I have previously sent compliance documents to Ms. Jansen's attention. They are specifically a Michigan registration and driver's license. Uh, but there is a question, Ms. Young, that the registration and insurance is that in the name of Kaya Jones? Yes, Kaya Jones. Correct. Is that the same vehicle that you were involved in the uh, that you got these tickets in, or is that a different vehicle? Yes, it's the yes. same. Okay, that's so. That's what she needs to know. I'm going to send that information to uh, Miss Jansen, 
And since it is the vehicle in question, I'm going to presume that there will be a compliance stipulation here. All right, she has her license now. You have your license now, Ms. Young? Yes, I have my license. Okay. All right. Well, let me know. We can recall this matter, okay? Sure. I think that's what we're asking at this time. All right, Ms. Young, just hold tight. They got to check over some of the stuff and make sure that it is the same exact vehicle that you're presenting documents for, okay? Okay. Put you back um, in your room. honor that one is a dismissal no Just thank you us. thank you miss jansen well, we don't have to put you back in the room miss young <laughs> they did check over your documents and they see that you now have the correct information up to date so at this time they're going to dismiss this matter without prejudice miss young i hope you learned a lesson about driving vehicles that aren't registered and all of that the trouble it causes okay okay all right there's nothing further you're all set have a good day. Um, you know, that your you honor. Yes. I'm sorry. I just wanted to clarify. It wasn't based on the documents that she submitted, but we did review with the officer who happens to be here, Officer Borsch, um, that the vehicle was plated after the stop. So okay. that's a different vehicle that she sent paperwork for. Just so you know, Harry. Thank you. Okay. All right. All right. Thank, Thank you, for, you for your attention to the details, Ms. Jansen, and your recommendation here. Thank you. Um, Ms. Young, there is one ticket that's a defective windshield that went into default a while ago. That still has to be paid. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. All right. If there's nothing further, though, that concludes this hearing. Have a good day, Ms. Young. You too. Thank you so much, ma'am. You're welcome. Thank you, Attorney Jansen. Thank you, Your Honor. Sure. I'm bringing in Angelo Young. Angelo Young? Yes. All right. I missed the end. Do I, am I sitting in my bed today? No, I had um I had laid down. They said they didn't know if it was going to be hours. <laughs> I know we moved a little quickly today, Mr. Young. Okay. So you gotta be ready. Okay. We're ready to put you on the record now, okay? Oh, yes, ma'am. All right. Now calling the matter of the people versus Angelo Young. This is ticket P1336778. Count one, smoking marijuana within the passenger area of a vehicle upon public highway. Count two, open alcohol in a motor vehicle. Driver. Count three, no proof of insurance. Appearances for the record, starting with counsel, please. Good morning. Harry Boffman for the defendant. Sir, state your full name, please. Angelo LaShawn Young. Thank you and good morning uh, again, Judge. This is a date and time for a trial. I do not believe we have a complaining witness, so I'd ask you to consider here today a motion to dismiss this case without prejudice. Well, the time is now 9.58 a.m. Let's see what the officers having appeared for these particular matters, the court is going to grant your request. I'm going to dismiss these matters without prejudice. Mr. Young, they can refile yes, this if they want to, okay? Yes, ma'am. As of today, you are all set, okay? Thank you, Judge. You're welcome. All right, that concludes this hearing. Thank, Thank you, Mr. Boffman. All right, you're welcome. Have a great day. You too. Attorney Magnuson. Good morning, Judge. I'm uh, arriving late. I apologize. I, I had to be out in Oakland County. Um, uh, I'm here on a uh, uh, Mr. Warmack. Okay. This is afternoon at one thirty. Oh, this afternoon at 1.30? Yes. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Have a good day. I'll see you later. Okay. Bye. Bye. All right. Let me bring in... Attorney Magidson? 
Yes. Yep. I'll, I'll meet with you. I'm sorry. No, no, that's perfect. Attorney Jansen, go ahead. Because I won't be here this afternoon, so. Okay. You want to meet with counsel real quick so you can figure that out for this afternoon? Yeah, perfect. Let, let's okay. let's uh, let's get into All a, right. uh, yeah. Thank you so much, Attorney Jansen. I'll put you in a breakout room with her. Y'all in five. Go to five. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank, Thank you. you. Lynn Williams? Hello? Hello. Now calling the matters of the people versus Lynn Arthur Williams. This is ticket number P1158974, count one in proper place, count two no insurance misdemeanor, count three drove unregistered and untitled vehicle, ticket P1161489, count one drove by license suspended, repeat offender, Ticket number P1199916, drove by license suspended. Ticket P1242491, count two, no insurance misdemeanor. Count three, failed to display a valid operator's license, not on person. Ticket number P1252147, count one, drove by license, not valid or improper license, construction zone. Count, oh, ticket number... Ticket number P1325743, count one, improper plates, count two, drove while license not valid or improper license. Appearances for the record, starting with counsel, please. Good morning, Harry Bachman, on behalf of the defendant, sir, state your name, please. Lynn Williams, Lynn Arthur Williams. Thank you, Mr. Williams. The defendant is going to waive rights to any further hearings and plead guilty. I believe he's here for an arraignment, so for that purpose, we'll ask that a not guilty plea be entered, but he's going to waive rights and, and plead guilty today. There's a recommendation. Uh, several counts are going to be dismissed here on his behalf. In order to ratify this agreement, I would stipulate to probable cause as to the matter being dismissed. Thank you. Okay. Let me open up my email. All right, so two counts of improper place. Is that my understanding? Okay. Attorney, well, okay, I got it. Attorney Jansen, I just have a quick question for you, too. Um, yes. He has another case um, for a show cause in 314.23. Okay. Roll license not valid or improper license. Can I add this as a part of the offer or no? Uh, yeah, you can. Okay, thank you very much. No right. problem. Uh, no problem. Okay, thank you. Okay. Yep. This ticket number SP1344294. This is one count drove by license, not valid or improper license. Um, it's not on the record, the docket for today is scheduled for a show cause on 314-2022. But I've asked counsel to please allow this case to be a part of this so that you don't have to come back, Mr. Williams. Okay. And she's gonna allow you to do that. So the offer is still the same. It's just going to be an additional ticket that's dismissed today. Okay, Mr. Williams? Yes, ma'am. All right. Please raise your right hand for me. Do you swear or affirm to tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? Yes. Okay. Put your hand down, Mr. Williams. Did you have a chance to talk to Attorney Balkman about your case and about your rights? Yes. Did anyone threaten you, force you, or promise you anything in exchange for a plea today? No. Are you pleading guilty of your own free will? Yes. 
Are you pleading guilty because you are guilty? Yes, ma'am. And do you understand that by taking this guilty plea today, that you're going to give up the rights that you had to have a bench or a jury trial in any of these matters? You understand that? Yes. Understanding all of that, did you still want to move forward today? Yes. All right, sir. I'm going to take you first back to the date of let's see, March 8th of 2022. Were you in the area of Southfield Service Drive in Plymouth in the city of Detroit driving a Chrysler vehicle, sir? Yes, yes, I was. And did it have improper plates on it at that time? Yes. Also, drawing your attention back to the date of February 8th of 2021, were you in the area of Plymouth and Greenfield in the city of Detroit driving a Chrysler vehicle, sir? Yes, I was. And did it have improper plates on it at the time? Yes, it didn't. Yes, it did? Yeah, it didn't have the okay. um, proper place. All right. That's that's I, I am, Mr. Both counts. Thank you so much. Stipulation for probable cause on the remaining counts to be dismissed? Yes, Your Honor. So stipulated. All right. So at this time, the court is going to enter a plea to two counts of improper place. The remaining counts on this record today will be dismissed. Mr. Williams. Yes. You know you owe a ton of money to the court, right? Yes, I do. Have you come down here and attempted to put together a payment plan? Um, I came recently, about two weeks ago, but I haven't made no payment plan to start paying these tickets that I have with you. But I would like to. No, I'm saying you got to make a payment plan. So yeah, I don't want to keep stacking money, but I'm a, I am because you keep driving. So I got to give you a fine on at least one of these tickets. I'm gonna make one of the tickets $200. I'm gonna waive the cost of fines on the other ticket, but you have to come down here and make a payment arrangement. You have four pages worth of tickets that you need to pay, Mr. Williams. Four pages. Okay. Four pages, okay? I understand. You gotta come down here and you need to figure something out. So that way you can come and start making a little chunk at it and pay, pay it away. Because what ends up happening is that eventually they do send these to someone to garnish your wages. And you don't want that to happen. Okay? Right. It All takes right, so a while, but eventually we do send it to a collector so that we can get the money. Okay, Mr. Okay. Williams? But if you come down here and you figure something out with this, then you should be able to, to get this all together, okay? Okay, I will. I'll come to the cashier, right? And talk yeah, to her. Yeah, go to the cashier and tell them, okay? And I can't just okay. let you get away scot-free today because we yeah. just missed quite a few tickets. So I have to... You know I would what? like to come and make a payment as soon as possible. Are some of these people... Hold on a minute. Oh. I just want to make sure that these ones are in the default. Then I'll let you take care of the plan. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. Okay. I'm going to do this. Oh, okay. One second, Mr. Williams. I'm trying to get, I just got to figure something out. Okay. So the first is a Oh.
All right, here's what I'm gonna do, Mr. Williams. I'm gonna waive the cost of fines on both of them because some of these tickets on here are civil infraction based tickets. And you, you have a lot. I'm not gonna add to it. Okay, but you gotta come down here and make some type of payment plan. I don't see I do that this Friday. I don't even be missing the page. Huh? I'm trying to see. I'm trying to figure out because I try not to overload you with a whole bunch of things. You got more pages? Oh, yeah, I'm not. All right, I'm waiving your cost and fines today. Only because you have to come back and make a payment arrangement for all of the other tickets that you have, okay? I don't list two additional tickets. You got six pages worth of tickets. Mr. Williams. Mr. Williams, I need you to come take care of this, okay? I will as soon as possible this Friday. Okay. Don't come. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I'm not gonna charge you any more money. You got enough stuff to worry about, okay, Mr. Williams? Come. Pay, uh, make a payment arrangement on Friday, okay? And then you start will. making little chips away at it, okay? I You'll will. be amazed what $50 every couple of months does to get, get this down to a more reasonable number. It may take you some a long period of time, but they'll give it to you as long as you're making some, some leeway at it, okay? Okay. All right, good luck to you, okay? Now, don't mess up, because if you come back and I see you, Mr. Williams, I remember faces. Okay. Okay. All right. You All right, thank you. I do, and you'll be surprised. I really remember faces real well. All right. All right, Mr. Williams, good luck to you, though. Please come down here and try and get this together, because I know I know it's difficult. It's going to be a large number, but just do the best you can, okay? Okay, I will. All right. I'll see you. Have a good day. All right, you too. Thank you. No problem. Officer um, Patman and Borshka, that's they right? Good morning, Anna. It's Officer Borsh. Good morning, Anna. Okay. Good morning, Officer. Um, Mr. Blake Williams did not check in. To oh, yes, he is. He's here. He's in the waiting room, and I have an offer if um, he can be admitted. I didn't realize he was here. Okay. He just got here. It's a little late. What's happening? Good morning. Good morning. All right, hold tight, officers. Then. Okay, no problem. Mr. Wells Williams. Yes. Good morning, sir. My name is Boffman. I'm your attorney. I'd like to meet you in a breakout room. So we can talk together. I'm going to send you to breakout room number two. Would you accept? Yes. Um, the prompt. You see it now? I see you there. Okay. Right. Oh, he must have, Judge, he must have appeared on the screen, and I thought that he had talked to Mr. Boffman and put him in the waiting room, so that's how he got in here. It's okay. I will say he showed up in the offices here, so since we had a lighter morning, I'll let him slack today.
I'm turning you off. I need just one more second on Mr. Uh, Williams. So I'm going to get Angela Wells out real quick and do him. And then we'll come back to Mr. Williams. Okay, you got one. I think it's going to be. She got these two got all these Yes, ma'am. All right. Now calling the matter of the people versus D'Angelo Wells. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay. Ticket number P112331010. Just tell me. One cop drove while license not valid or improper license. Count two, no insurance misdemeanor. Also calling ticket number P1319846. Count one, 11 to 15 miles over post speed. Count two, failed to permit valid operator license not a person. Also calling ticket number SP1360998. Count one, drove while license not valid or improper license. Count two, that ticket is disregard traffic control device. Appearances for the record, starting with counsel, please. Good morning, Harry Boffman for the defendant. State your name, please, sir. D'Angelo Wills. Thank you. Uh, Judge, I think we're here for uh, an arraignment. Oh no, we're here for pretrial. The defendant uh, attended the better driver's course. He's receiving today the best offer from the prosecution available based on his uh, attendance of that course. Uh, he's going to plead guilty and there's a recommendation in the file. All right. All right, sir. The recommendation is that you do one count of one to five, reduce for speeding. The remaining cases scheduled will be dismissed. I I couldn't understand you. The case is going. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, the case is going to be reduced down to one to five over speeding. That's a hundred twenty-five dollar ticket, and the remaining tickets will be dismissed today. You understand that, Mr. Wells? Yes, ma'am. All right. So, reading from the ticket to establish a factual basis on the. Date of March 8th, 2022, in the area of East Seven Mile and Shoner Streets in the city of Detroit. Mr. Wells was driving a Dodge vehicle and did speed doing one to five miles over posted speed. Satisfied, counsel? Satisfied. Thank you, Your Honor. I would stipulate to probable cause as to all the matters being dismissed here on behalf of the defendant. All right. So at this time, the court's going to enter that plea to one to five miles over speed. The remaining tickets on the docket today will be dismissed. Sir, the fine is $125. Typically, you have 14 days to be able to pay civil infractions. Is that going to be enough time for you? Uh, yes, ma'am. All right. So that's going to be due no later than February 20th of 2023, okay? Okay. All right, sir. Yes, ma'am. There's nothing further. You are all set, okay? Okay, thank you. You're very welcome, okay? Mr. Magnuson, first, can I have your P number, please? P number 25581. Are you back? So I spoke with the uh, prosecutor. I don't see her, Ms. Jansen. And uh, we worked out a resolution. And she said that um, because I, I, it turns out I have another matter up at uh, 1 30. But she said if my client uh, was uh, amenable to the uh, offer, uh that maybe we could sneak uh in today and uh, do the plea and uh have you do one less thing this afternoon so yes. i get your client on the phone mr magnuson i will do it okay uh i yeah uh, i will do that right now. i talked to him and he's trying to zoom in but he's not really comfortable doing that well maybe i can call him right now and uh, get him on the phone if that's good for you what do you mean you're not comfortable zooming in? 
Well, he he doesn't. He, he's just not a a savant when it comes to the Zoom technology. Now he knew he had a hearing this afternoon. What was he gonna do? Let me. Well, he, 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 he was gonna figure it out. He's he. he I, I I might have uh, um, he's getting uh, he's getting ready for court as we speak. So I, I'm hoping that he gets there within the next uh, three or four minutes. Okay. All right. I, I hold tight. Okay. I we told him. Yeah, I told him no wife beaters and things like that. So he's it's going to take him a minute. I appreciate that. Though. I'll hold tight. Okay. If you can hold tight, I'll hold tight too. Okay. Thanks, Judge. I appreciate you. You're very welcome, of course. Mr. Williams, Blake Williams, I'm ready for your matter now. Okay. All right, we're gonna get you out of here. Yes. All right. All right, you done added us. I don't think the hair wrap was on there first. I need to take the hair wrap and the... Mr. Williams, do you have a head yes. covering? Can you remove your head covering? Please? It was not for religious purposes. Yes. Mr. Williams, you have background noise. It's interfering with the meeting. Could you um, yes. either mute your device or turn that device down? And what happened to him? Now calling the matters of the people versus Blake Williams. This is ticket number P1148852. Count one, no insurance misdemeanor. Count two, drove while license suspended. Ticket number P124753. Count one, disregard officer signature, offer sig officer signal. Count two, drove while license suspended. Ticket number P1351018. One count failed to display a valid operator's license not on person. Count two, no insurance misdemeanor. Count three, drove unregistered, untitled vehicle. Ticket number SP1320639. Count one, stop street or intersection failed to stop. Count two, drove while license suspended. Count three, improper place. Appearances for the record, starting with counsel, please. Morning, Harry Boffman for the defendant. Sir, state your full name for the record. You're on mute, sir. Blake Williams. Thank you, Mr. Williams. There are also officers from the Detroit Police Department. Would you, one at a time, please state your name for the record. Yes, Officer DeMar Patman, Bash 24. Officer Boris, Bash 24. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, Officer Boris, Bash 2102, Traffic Enforcement. Thank you, good officers. Um, good morning. The defendant is aware of his right to a trial this morning, Your Honor. He's going to waive that right here and now. Today, he's going to plead guilty. There is a recommendation. There are matters that are being dismissed here. Based on that recommendation, and I'm going to stipulate to probable cause as for those dismissals, the defendant stands ready to make a factual base. All right. Do you understand that, sir? You want to take advantage of that today? Yes. All right. Did you stipulate to the ticket? I forgot. I turned the button. Sorry. Sure. Uh, for the purpose of the plea, we stipulate to the four corners of the face of any ticket or complaint. 
Thank you so much. So at this time, the court's going to enter a plea to the reduced charge of one to five miles over posted speed, as well as one count of expired play. Sir, the fine for that is $125 for the speeding ticket, $145 for the expired plate. Typically, you have 14 days to pay civil infractions. That's $270. Is that going to be enough time to pay that much, 14 days? No, Your Honor. All right. I'm going to give you, well, I can give him until his next court date. What's next? Because he has another court date with me, Attorney Baldwin, for some other oh. cases. <laughs> Mr. Williams. 322. See, there's some other expired So he has some more tickets that are coming forth. I don't know if they're new or the show cause status, but he has a new date with me on 322.23. I know we had somebody set at trials today, though. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to interfere with that. Sir, I'll give you until that date to have that fine paid of $270, and I'll see you back for those matters before me. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yes. Sir, Don't you go. also have three tickets that are civil infractions. Call and get a court date for those so that that way they, they don't go into default. Okay. 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 So call the court and say you have some civil infractions that you need to be placed on a docket so that they don't go into default so that you won't have, so we can make these, all of these tickets like we did today, parts of pleas, okay? I saw that okay. you were paying some money on it, so I know you're making some efforts towards it, but we got to get you all together on everything, okay? Okay. All right, Mr. Williams, if there's nothing further, I'll see you for your next date. I gave you about two months to pay, okay? Okay. All right, Mr. Williams, I'll see you back then, okay? Thank you, Your Honor. You're very welcome, all right? Bye-bye. All right. All right, thank you, boss, man. Go ahead. See you all later. Have a great Bye. day, everybody. Bye.